Hey everybody, this video will talk about domain and range from the graph of a quadratic function. So if we're given a graph of a quadratic function, and in this function the vertex is at 2, 3 as shown in the figure. Find the domain and range. Write the domain and range using interval notation. So we can look at the graph and we could say, well, the domain is a set of all x values in which the function has outputs. So all of the inputs on the, or the numbers on the x-axis where we're going to have a piece of our function. Now this piece continues infinitely in both directions. So no matter how negative we go, we're still going to have our function. So our domain is going to go from negative infinity to infinity. And then our range. Our range is found by using this vertex point. The vertex point is either the maximum or the minimum the function or the output values will ever get. Here it's the smallest because it's a minimum. So the smallest our function outputs will ever get is 3. See how that vertex is at the value y is 3. So we can go, the range will go from 3 to infinity.